I've only gotten out four times this year and three of those were doctor appointments and it's just it's been tough guys and not only that but it's just can't really tell she's in such a tough spot with so many anaphylaxis and her health is just so serious. Good morning guys. I'm resting with my little symbol doll and he wants to say hi. She's so sweet. She's been sleeping on my chest like she likes. But what's really sweet is she also likes to curl up in my hand while she's sleeping on my chest because she just wants all the cuddles and that makes me so happy. She's such a cuddly darling and I love her. I love all my four darlings. <laughs> but it, um yeah, it's been a rough day for me so far. I've been keeping my bedroom for a lot to deter people from talking to me. <laughs> and, yeah. And hoping that so sometimes she'll come in my room, stare at the wall, and laugh. For no reason. And then she leaves. And she won't close my door back, even when I ask her to. So, yeah, there's people out there who can help us, so if she needs anything, say if she needs help with changing a movie or with whatever, mom is there, Hannah's there, Kelly's even home. Not that Kelly can help her, but mom and Kelly, Hannah are out there. So if she needs help, there's people who can help us. So I was locking my door, <laughs> but it's just not been fun. I got to bed late last night, and then I woke up after only five hours, and... I was worried I was going to throw up. I was scared I had a stomach virus or something. And it took me hours to get back to sleep, guys. I don't know why. Thankfully, I don't seem to have a stomach virus because it's fine now. But it's just, I feel so rough after that. And I'm just, my sensory processing disorder, I'm hypersensitive today, which is why I don't want people talking to me, or touching me, or being standing too close to me. And, um, the pain is high, and uh, my neck hurts, and I just feel so worn out. So, yeah. But I took, uh, like, I think three day vlogging break because my depression was worse. Um, Night before last, I found myself randomly baking at midnight because of the depression, which, for baking, I just altered a family pie recipe, and um, it's a custard pie with meringue, and I made that without the pie crust, and I made it into mini custards, so that was really good. Mama Kelly and I enjoyed those as a midnight snack, but I'm just not feeling good guys I just want to go back to sleep but there's really no point in going back to sleep because it'll just mess up my sleeping schedule even more um actually I woke up after, after only four hours of sleep because it took me an unusually long point time to get to sleep last night usually I can fall asleep right away but last night took me an hour so yeah um but I need to edit a vlog but I don't feel like doing that right now so I'm not going to I'm just catching up on watching vlogs on YouTube. I missed two days worth. Well, uh, actually, I missed two days worth. I, just, I have yesterday's and today, so I have two days worth, but I didn't miss two days. So, whatever. I'm catching up on those, so that's nice. But I don't feel like talking, so I'm gonna go rest and I'll see y'all more later. Hey guys, um, happy Sunday. Yeah, it was just Monday, but. I was like really feeling badly and really sleeping. I kept falling asleep and so I was not able to film an ending clip for Saturday. So now it's Sunday and it's actually uh, really really late like after midnight. <laughs> I've been meaning to pick up the camera all day but I've been feeling really bad guys because the storm system's coming in and every time I went to go start filming I realized I forgot to pick up the camera. While I was up because it was across the room and I did not feel up to getting out of bed to get the camera. So I finally got out of bed and got the camera. 
but yeah, right now I just finished recovering from taking a bath, so that was nice, really relaxing, and yeah, um, some exciting stuff is happening tomorrow, so I'm really, really happy, and I hope I can catch up on the vlog soon, so y'all can see, because I'm just, oh, I'm unbelievably excited, but it's a surprise, and so I can't tell y'all, y'all have to wait to see tomorrow, but for the surprise, I'd really like ideally to have my laundry put away that I have piled up before my closet that I've been too sick to put away. I don't know if I can. I've been so sick today, but I'm going to try at least doing what I can. Maybe I can at least put a few items away. We'll see. But I'm so excited, guys. Uh, but it sucks that there's so much rain this week. Um, but I'm sorry again though about the vlog that I've not been filming consistently, that I've not been editing consistently. It's just been hard lately with my health and my depression and everything. It's just, it's been really discouraging honestly with my health guys. I just, I've been pretty much bed bound for so long and it's just really getting to me because uh, it's almost equal and I've hardly done anything feels like I just I've only gotten out four times this year and three of those were doctor appointments and it's just it's been tough guys and not only that but it's just Caroline tells she's in such a tough spot with so many anaphylaxis and her health is just so serious that's really concerning and it's been a tough spot but this surprise will help with all of our stress levels so I'm excited about it and yeah, but I can't really say more than that, but I will see y'all in a bit before I go to bed. I'm so happy, put away the clothes. It took an hour and a half, but I did it. I watched it anyway, all I did which helped. But I, I went out, but I'll show y'all. See, it had been all piled in front of my dresser and I was having to climb over baskets of laundry to get to Thimble's box. Which is in the closet. So it's much better now, but it's with my bronchitis and the pleurisy and just and asthma and all of my lung problems and all my other symptoms. This is my first time being able to put my laundry away since December. So it's gonna be much easier to find my clothes now that I don't have to just get whatever's at the top of the pile because I was too sick to even dig through the pile. So yeah, that was difficult <laughs> but I'm so happy I'm so on out guys hopefully tomorrow I can vacuum the carpet that would be great but just getting that laundry gone makes me look so much bigger I'm really happy about that but now it wasn't something I had to do for tomorrow's surprise but it's a lot better for it so now I'm already <laughs> I'm so one out. Tomorrow's going to be a long, exciting day. I'm so excited. And hopefully I can catch up on vlogs so that way I can show y'all as soon as possible. Uh, but I need to get some sleep. I need to rest. I'm so tired. So I'll see y'all tomorrow. Good night. Thank you for watching. And thank you for putting up with my recent um, inconsistencies with vlogging. I'm trying to get better, really. Mm -hmm.